Nina, Hi. tell me about FAM. FAM is the new show that I'm doing. It is a multicam, multicam, I keep, always say that weird, multicam sitcom on CBS. It's about um, a modern day family which, uh, my character is a bit of a hot mess, train wreck type that is trying to change her ways. She's inspired by her, uh, the man that she met who she's in love with and she tells him that her family is dead because they're so terrible that she never wants him to meet them. And of course, when he proposes, they show up and threaten to destroy the world that she's created. Gosh. Yeah. That's a crazy plot. Uh, do you believe in real life there is such thing as this perfect life? Like you can escape all your troubles and kind of invent your own? No, I don't actually. I feel like nothing is perfect, nor should it be perfect. And you should expect that everything's gonna change and at some point you're gonna go through ups and downs and highs and lows and it's a roller coaster that's the what the journey of life is now this is a live show which I would imagine could be nerve-wracking so how mm -hmm. do you calm your nerves before you go on I thought you were saying this is a live show I was like really? this is not a live show <laughs> <laughs> everyone is not seeing this right now um, I I just focus into the zone and and have someone that I run lines with over and over and over and over again and I just kind of don't talk I don't bring my phone to set when I'm shooting Wow! I leave it in my dressing room and I just focus and run lines over and over and over again because it's live so if you make a mistake people see it and I don't like making mistakes in front of people yeah what do you love about this cast because you have a very funny cast I do well I'm very lucky my co-stars are incredibly funny and talented Tone Bell is hilarious. He and I had worked together previously. That's how we came to this project together. And Odessa Adlon, my little sister, is amazing. Brian Stokes Mitchell and Cheryl Lee Ralph are both seasoned sitcom actors and and veterans of this industry, I would say. Uh, I relied on them and Tone a lot for tips and advice, and they definitely have had my back and helped me out a lot, as I am a baby in this world. <laughs> What's it like going from a drama like Vampire Diaries now crossing over to comedy? It's very different. They're so different. I mean, the live audience aspect is, is one big one. The, um, the fact that it's a straight comedy, the fact that it's a lot broader. You have to be bigger on sitcoms. Yeah. You have to enunciate and project for the people in the audience. It's kind of like doing a, a mini play every single week and you get a new script every week that you have to memorize and they change the lines every day up until and even during the live taping. They'll come in and whisper a new line in your ear and you have to test it out in front of the audience for the first time. Oh my gosh, yeah. that's a lot of pressure. It is, but it also makes it fun and keeps you on your toes. You, you, you have to sort of be very sharp and focused and, and you can't really slack off in those environments, Jeez. you know, which is good. It yeah. keeps, it, it's a cancer for complacency. There you go. And Paul came and visited you on set to yeah. watch a taping, right? Yeah, he um, he's doing a show with Aaron Kaplan, our producer, a different one called Tell Me, Tell Me Your Story, Tell Me a Story. And so he was meeting with Aaron and it happened to be a tape night. So Aaron was like, let me, why don't I take you over to the, to the fam set? You can see Nina. And so he stayed and watched and it was a great little reunion.